The 52nd Annual Junior Science and Humanities Symposium, or JSHS, took place in Washington, D.C., April 24th through the 27th, in conjunction with the USA Science and Engineering Festival. JSHS is a program funded by the Army, Navy, and the Air Force designed to encourage high school students to conduct original research in the fields of science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, known as STEM. At the four-day event, 230 students competed as they presented their findings and research to a panel of judges. The JSHS uh, festival is very important because it's actually a capstone in bringing the high school students here and they're really able to show their talents in respect to the projects that they're doing with respect to science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. And I have to tell you, after going through the poster sessions, listening in on some of the presentations, I was absolutely impressed. I, I think some of this stuff is equivalent to master's level work in, in terms of thesis, and it really shows the, the dedication and the work that we have with some of our top-notch high school students. It's very promising, it's very exciting. The level of research conducted by the students also impressed RDECOM's director, Dale Orman. I cannot tell you how overwhelmed I was walking around looking at the poster session. And clearly a lot of it is graduate level science and engineering these, these students are doing. Um, I was just amazed by the, the, the breadth of subjects. I mean, everything from quantum to wastewater treatment to biology to anthropology, I mean, it was just shocking. And I uh, got a chance to look through some of them, and the complexity and the thinking that was going on is, is truly amazing for, for high school students. The USA Science and Engineering Festival bills itself as one of the largest celebrations of science and engineering in the country featuring over 3,000 activities, 150 stage shows, a career and college fair, and a book fair. The Army was well represented with exhibits and interactive displays such as food science, unmanned ground vehicles, thermal vision, 3D terrestrial laser, additive manufacturing with 3D printing, physical modeling, unmanned aircraft systems, and high-speed imagery, among others. The JSHS competition is just one of many Army educational outreach programs. We offer different ranges of experience, hands-on engagement through our gains in engineering, math and science program, GEMS, uh, our competitions through eCyber Mission and through JSHS. Again, we're, we like to, to foster that and, and, and interest in the student, help it grow, make sure they are aware that the DoD has really tough problems that we need people to work on. So that's why the Army is interested in it because we know that in the future, nearly every job that anyone is going to have is going to require STEM competency. At the Walter E. Washington Convention Center in Washington, D.C., for Army Technology Live, I'm Dennis Neal.